these have been on our wrists for quite a long and with time have evolved from being mechanical to smart. Today we have Samsung Galaxy Watch 5 and Watch 6 with us. Hey everyone, welcome to our channel. As far as the look is concerned, you can't make out the changes with just looking at them. Which is why we are going to have a closer look to see the minute changes. Let's talk about the most prominent and welcome one, the bezel. Like the company claims, it's now 30% slimmer and hence the display is now 20% larger than before. On paper, 20% might not sound much, but it enhances the display, makes the watch look more modern and sleek. A side-by-side -side look with the same watch face reveals the extra screen space you have now. And you can see the difference is noticeable. What's not changed is the sapphire crystal glass in the front and our passion to provide you with more and more content which is why hit a like button and don't forget to subscribe to the channel. Coming to the back, it's uh, nearly identical. Only thing is if you notice, the font size is smaller in watch 6 compared to watch 5. On the sides, left, there's nothing but a sleek pair of speaker grills on both of them. Not very loud, but enough to take an outdoor call. On the right, we have a microphone a home and a back button. They are still rectangular in shape and upon a closer look you can make out that the buttons on white 6 are more refined and slightly elongated than before. One more thing is that the side aluminum frame is a bit thicker on watch 6. And I suppose that should now provide more protection if you happen to drop it on the sides. Talking about another highlighted feature this year the band release mechanism. There's a quick release mechanism for changing the band. Unlike previously where you need to slide that small lever with your nail. Now what they have provided is a release button which you need to push to take out the band. Although I would say it's not easy as it sounds. The good thing is that these one click watch band are compatible with your previous watch 5 and watch 4 as well. The bands are 20 mm silicon by default. Apart from this, other subtle changes include a faster processor. The resolution has been bumped up compared to earlier. RAM has been upgraded to 2 GB from 1.5 GB last year. Battery is now 300 mAh from 284mh although the usage time is the same 40 hours with always on display off as previous. The peak brightness is doubled to 2000 nits. Overall there is no such drastic changes but incremental updates just like the S23 Ultra this year but it does enhance your overall experience. That's all for today. What do you think about these incremental updates? Let us know in the comment section below.